Ireland's first woman president elected. On this day, 27 years ago, the Irish people have elected a figure named Mary Robinson as their first female president. Has not been officially announced, but unofficial results show that she got 40% of the vote in the first round. Ireland's representative system means that new election results can be confirmed the next day. However, Mary's superiority at the beginning of the meeting is unlikely to be another figure who will win the election. Mary the victory itself was quickly recognized by the opposing camp, and for the first time in 70 years, the candidate promoted by the Fianna Fáil party had to lose. Mary who is an advocate in Dublin is considered a radical. He is a civil and human rights lawyer who has been campaigning to liberalize the law prohibiting divorce and abortion for more than 20 years. Victory, Maria is not only supported by women all over the country, but it also has the support of the activated rural areas. The mother of three has been a member of the Irish Senate for more than 20 years. She had twice failed to sit in Parliament as a candidate for the Labour Party. Mary was listed as the seventh President of Ireland, from December 1990 to September 1997. She ran from the Labour Party and was also supported by the Green Party and the Workers' Party. In her country's history, Mary is remembered for helping to change the role of the President of Ireland from a ceremonial position to a more influential one. S. He was founded a few months before the end of his term, in 1997, to become the United Nations Commissioner for Human Rights. Hers frank criticism and uncompromising criticism of the human rights records of a number of countries angered governments in various parts of the world. He sparked criticism from the United States after outspoken the detention of an al-Qaeda suspect at Guantanamo Bay in Cuba. The woman held the post of United Nations Commissioner until 2002 and thereafter announced that she was interested in seeking a second term. Other history records that on a 8, 1939 Nazi Germany's leader Adolf Hitler escaped an assassination attempt in Munich. On November 8, 1987, a bomb exploded in Northern Ireland to coincide with the anniversary of the end of World War I. Among them 11 people died in the incident. Thanks for watching till the end. Don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe. See you next time.